Have you ever wondered what the most luxurious homes in the United States look like? Imagine stepping into a world of opulence where every detail is designed to exude extravagance and grandeur. From sprawling estates with acres of land to breathtaking architectural masterpieces, these homes are a testament to wealth, power, and a touch of eccentricity. Today, we're going on a journey to explore the biggest and most extravagant mansions in America. We'll delve into the history of these architectural marvels, uncover the stories behind their creation, and take a virtual tour of their opulent interiors. Biltmore Estate, a Gilded Age Masterpiece George Washington Vanderbilt II Heir to Cornelius Vanderbilt's railroad fortune, envisioned Biltmore Estate as an escape from New York City's frenzy. Inspired by French chateaux, he commissioned architect Richard Morris Hunt to craft a Gilded Age masterpiece. Construction began in 1889, employing 1,000 workers and spanning six years at an unprecedented cost of $6 million. Biltmore showcases exquisite craftsmanship with North Carolina granite walls, intricate carvings, stained glass, and imported marble, housing an array of art and antiques like Renaissance paintings and French tapestries. Beyond its opulent interiors, the estate boasts 8,000 acres of forests, gardens, and a working farm. Visitors explore by foot, bike, or horse-drawn carriage, making it a premier U.S. tourist spot, drawing 1.4 million annual visitors keen on Gilded Age history, art, and architecture. Ohika Castle, a symbol of opulence and intrigue. Perched atop a hill in Old Westbury, Long Island, Ohika Castle stands as a majestic reminder of the Gilded Age a period of unprecedented wealth and extravagance in American history. Built in 1919 by investment banker Otto Hermann Kahn, the 127-room mansion was designed in style of a French chateau, inspired by the grandeur of the Loire Valley. Kahn, a German-born American financier, was also known for his lavish lifestyle and his patronage of the arts. He commissioned architects Delano and Aldrich to design a home that would reflect his wealth and status. The resulting masterpiece is a testament to their skill and imagination. Ohika Castle features intricate carvings, ornate moldings, and lavish interiors. The mansion's grand hall, with its soaring ceilings and marble staircase, is a breathtaking sight. The drawing room, adorned with gold leaf and silk draperies, exudes elegance and sophistication. The castle's grounds are equally impressive, encompassing over 44 acres of manicured lawns, formal gardens, and a reflecting pool. A tennis court, a golf course, and a greenhouse were among the many amenities enjoyed by Khan and his guests. Ohika Castle has hosted a long list of notable figures, including royalty, heads of state, and Hollywood stars. In its heyday, the castle was a scene of lavish parties and extravagant gatherings. Despite its opulent past, Ohika Castle has also had a turbulent history. After Khan's death in 1934, the castle passed through several hands and fell into disrepair. In the 1970s, it was nearly demolished to make way for a housing development. However, a group of local residents rallied to save the castle, and in 1978, it was added to the National Register of Historic Places. The castle was subsequently restored and reopened as a hotel in 1988. Today, Ohika Castle remains a popular destination for weddings, events, and overnight stays. It continues to captivate visitors with its grandeur, elegance, and intriguing history. Xanadu 2.0, a technological paradise. Nestled by Lake Washington in Medina, Washington, Xanadu 2.0 is a 66,000 square foot mansion conceived by Microsoft's Bill Gates. It's a blend of cutting edge tech and luxury, earning its status as a prominent and intriguing American home. Gates, known for tech and philanthropy, 
designed Xanadu 2.0 to fuse advanced technology seamlessly with daily life. Sensors adjust lighting, temperature, and entertainment upon entry, while embedded screens provide real-time info throughout the mansion. The home's tech marvels go beyond convenience, with a 60-foot indoor pool and an underwater viewing room, a vast library, and a top-tier home theater. Its eco-design includes geothermal heat pumps, solar panels, and rainwater collection. Despite its technological edge, Xanadu 2.0 maintains a welcoming feel, inspired by Pacific Northwest's beauty, featuring large windows showcasing stunning views and natural elements like wood and stone for warmth. Xanadu 2.0 stands as a pinnacle of modern architecture and technology, embodying Gates's vision, architectural brilliance, and 21st century innovation. Fairfield a Hamptons enclave of refined elegance. Perched on a sprawling 63-acre estate in Sagaponic, New York, Fairfield epitomizes the Hamptons' allure with its Georgian-style mansion spanning 110,000 square feet. Originally designed in the early 20th century by architect Peter Kerr for financier Robert W. Goldett, it harmonizes classic elegance with modern comforts inspired by England's Cotswolds estates. Its exterior charms with symmetrical facades, dormer windows, and a majestic portico. Inside, a lavish foyer welcomes guests with marble floors, ornate moldings, and a sweeping staircase. Grand salons and dining rooms adorned with exquisite furnishings set the stage for opulent gatherings. Fairfield's private quarters offer spacious bedrooms ensuite bathrooms, and private balconies overlooking the estate's expansive grounds. A state-of-the-art spa, a home theater, and a game room provide relaxation and entertainment. Its meticulously landscaped grounds by Frederick Law Olmsted boast lush gardens, winding pathways, and a serene pool. Outdoor offerings include a tennis court, croquet lawn, and putting green, creating an oasis of leisure. Previously owned by media mogul David Geffen, Fairfield hosted Hollywood's elite. Today, it stands as a symbol of elegance and architectural brilliance amid the vibrant Hamptons landscape. The One, a Bel Air mansion shrouded in controversy. Towering in Bel Air, Los Angeles, the One epitomizes opulence and architectural ambition. Its 105,000 square feet include a nightclub, a bowling alley, and deluxe spa, drawing global attention for its grandeur, tumultuous history, and controversy. Conceived by real estate tycoon David Geffen, the One aimed to redefine luxury, spanning a 9.4-acre estate crafted by renowned architect Paul McLean. Its sleek glass-clad exterior offers panoramic city views while inside, a series of spaces cater to luxurious living, featuring a grand living room, a top-notch kitchen, and a formal dining area. Yet, it's the extravagant amenities that truly distinguish it. A retractable roof bowling alley, nightclub, and a spa with a hammam and saltwater pool. A movie theater with an IMAX screen, a candy store, and a rare wine cellar cater to every indulgence. Despite nearly a decade of construction, the One's $500 million price tag sparked controversy, criticized for its size and ostentation. Its architectural merit was questioned, but it continues to fascinate luxury enthusiasts, even as it remains unsold. It stands as a symbol of ambition and excess, sparking admiration and debate as an extraordinary architectural marvel. The biggest mansions in America are more than just homes. They are architectural marvels, symbols of wealth and power, and testaments to the human imagination. From the Gilded Age grandeur of Biltmore Estate to the modern extravagance of the One, these mansions offer a glimpse into a world of unparalleled luxury and splendor. If you like this video, click the next one shown on the screen. 
I'm sure you like it. Thanks for watching.